after the break, we are going to get the lowdown on how the dapper older chap Graham went with the lovely Denise in their romantic night out on the town. Jason, I'm not sure, but I think she's come around to realising that I'm a fairly normal, nice enough guy, you know, I think. <laughs> Down, did you do samba, Denise? I need a drink, I really do. Welcome back to Blind Date. Now, former military man and Sean Connery look-alike, Graham, and the lovely Denise, are at the more worldly end of the Lonely Heart scale. But that didn't stop them from coming on the show looking for love. Please meet your Blind Date. Denise from Mossman in Sydney. <laughs> Well, joining us once again, would you please welcome Graham and Denise? Hello. Hello. Hi, lovely Hi. to see you. Hi. How are you? Come on over. <coughs> How lovely. Oh, my gosh. Hi, guys. Well, we sent both of you off on a little cocktail-making date. Let's see if you gave romance a little shake. <laughs> Well, when the screen went back and it revealed Denise, the first thought went through my mind was that she is a very good class of lady, not a bogan. When I first laid my eyes on Graham, he just wasn't what I expected. I've always been looking for a silver grey-haired fox, and Graham's dark. <laughs> oh, did he? Oh, I to see him. Oh, like that Mac. Yes. Very nice. Oh, She's pleasantly dressed and conservative, which is my type. And you ready? Yes, I'm head ready. Off. I am ready. Let's, yeah. let's go. You're great timing, by the way. Very let's good. Head for it. Very Thank good. You. Excellent. Mm, I need a drink. Really do. <laughs> Looking forward to enjoying getting to know Denise and, and excited. It's going to be another rum cocktail. Keep on the rum thing. Oh, yeah. Chapter 23, which is quite a rich decade of rums in Guatemala. There we are, darling. Watch you don't burn your lips. Oh, I don't know. <coughs> mm. Oh, yes. Mm. And then Graham made a martini. Shaken. I'm not stirred. I then uh, lived on my little James Bond uh, fantasy. No flies on me. And it goes. His voice and his looks really don't make the James Bond. Not my Sean Connery James Bond, anyway. Did you do samba, Denise? No, no. It's the Welsh wizard blood that comes out of me, you know? <laughs> smells very nice. We've had shaken, stirred, and poured now. But I think she's come around to realising that I'm a fairly normal, nice enough guy, you know, I think. <laughs> yeah, and cheers. Whoops, there we go. Cheers, yeah. Then we sat and we had drinks. I like to travel. I actually like horse riding, and I ended up being a drummer. And I do, I ski. I could design the houses, build it, sell it, blah, 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 blah. He just prattled on about his own little world. That is strong. Do you want to, do you want to try? I've had the um, on. flu. I don't want to give you that. Do you know I haven't had flu, cold, headache ever in my life? He just kept talking. You only did once. That's YOLO. Right. Remember yeah. that. <laughs> and we, I think we both realised that. Oh, you know, she's not bad, he's not bad, you know. I think. <laughs> I think the best thing about Denise is she's very grounded, she's educated, sensible lady. She could be like, you know, like the school teacher type, you know what I mean? Which is, you know, my type, believe it or not. This is a beautiful area, Denise. We can have a stay here for the night. Here we go. I've got it all booked up. I don't think I'd change anything about him. He is what he is. And I think he's, you know, in his own way, he's happy. So he'll be all right. <laughs> you just ask him. He'll be Come fine. back. <laughs> Oh, dear, dear, dear. Well, Graeme, you looked so dapper on the night. Were there any sparks flying for you? 
Uh, we had a good time. I mean, we've got a lot in common. I think, as I said, we both like travel and we've done a few things. Uh, and we've gone on fairly well, especially as the night went on and the cocktails got stronger. Oh, like. <laughs> and the wine got colder. Oh, got involved. Denise, did you get to speak? Not really. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> I really didn't get a chance to... To get my speak secrets, at all. Get my secrets, no, yeah. I like. Are you a secret keeper, Graham? Oh, you've got to keep a few dark secrets. I didn't. I didn't like Denise to, to know too much. <laughs> no, not on the first date. No, that's right. I was waiting for the second date. Exactly. And oh, oh, no, there'll goodness. be no second date. <laughs> <laughs> there will not. Sorry, Graham. No second date. <laughs> but you. But it looked like it was going so smoothly. Oh, what was I your thought. take on the date, Denise? Oh, look, I'm so. You're a nice guy, Graham, but he's not my type. Type. No, he just isn't. We've got nothing in common, I don't think. Even though it wasn't successful in a, in a romance way, mm -hmm. um, has it put you off dating? Um, yes, I'm, I'm happy on my own. <laughs> I'm very happy on my own. I do go to Brisbane occasionally, and I thought we could have perhaps caught up for lunch or something, but I don't think even that would work. Seriously, Graham, <laughs> do you? Well, if you paid, it would work. Yes, if, if you I paid. paid, I think it would work. That's why Graham's so wealthy, I think. He doesn't... Oh, like snake to... in the pocket. Yeah, and not for all the right reasons. Look, yes. joke, joking yeah. apart, I think that he's like a quite easy... Uh, meet up for a coffee, have a laugh and a joke and wind up about this. I mean, we could, because, you know, we're both yeah, nice people. Yeah, maybe we you could. Know, we could. We're, um, we understand where we are, where we're going and how we're going to get there. And it's in different directions. <laughs> 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 we really appreciate you guys coming back. Guys, will you please thank Graham and Denise? <laughs>